Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of the Let's Play series. Today we're going to take it a bit slow and just do some adventuring. I want to get my stuff ready to go to the end actually. Um, because I'm working very hard on other series and stuff like that. I just don't have the time to do a lot of building on this, so I'm taking this a bit slow. But I just noticed my villager standing up there and I have no clue how he managed to get up there. Like, he, he couldn't have gone through there. So he had to have used the door in here, but how did he get up? Can they climb ladders? Yeah, you, you gotta show me. Can you, can you walk in? Go go in the door. No. No. Show me how you got up here. No, you're just gonna stand there, aren't you? Can you <gasps> they can climb ladders! It's terrible, but they can't climb ladders, so technically I don't need this bed. Uh, anyhow, I'll fix up that little spot and then I'll continue on my way to go into the nether. I want to set up a portal towards the actual village so we can get more villages over here. And whilst doing that, I want to raid that uh, stronghold and also get, the, uh, get some place powders. Uh, it will take a bet with us, we got some torches, we got 12 obsidian, which should be enough to make a portal right, I believe. Or do we need 40? I, I gotta check this actually, because it would be dumb if I get this wrong. Uh, Alright, I'll, I'll be right back. And yes, I'm gonna take my full diamond stuff, so let's actually get like a... And this fishing world needs to be dumped. Alright, so I'll go into the nether, I'll check the coordinates for the village, and then we'll go and set up a nether portal. I just realized that I never made a diamond sword, so let's actually go ahead and do that as well. Because who doesn't love themselves a diamond sword? Here we go. Oh, that's a zombie. Alright, let's get over to that blaze so I can get myself some blaze rods. And I already found a chest. Ooh, diamond horse armor. Nice. Alright, let's take this with me. Uh, let's get the nether ward in here because it's smart to have some, right? There we go. Ooh, this looks so nice. It's so cool with shaders on. Uh, sorry if it's a bit dark. Uh, in case I find it too dark in the edit, I'll brighten it up a bit. So this is alright. Actually, got another flint and steel, which is nice. But I did bring my one with me because. Of course I need it. Alright, so there's a stairway down here. It Oh, there's even more over there. Uh, this is actually a pretty big thing. Uh, that's just two places. Ow. Okay, of course I get hit. Let's throw away that rotten flesh. I can't really use it for anything anyways. Uh, that's another chest. Uh, some gold stuff as well. This thing is massive though. It's actually really big. It's been a while since I've seen such a big nether fortress. Oh, there's actually more nether ward up here. I think this is actually the area I went in the first time around. So that seems like a dead end. Let's go and try to find a way to the village in a sec as well. Ow. Right, so the first few were clearly misses. Oh, this is nice. This is pretty flat already. So that might help with making a willow skeleton spawn platform. Yeah, this thing is absolutely huge. Which is great, to be honest. Right, let's kill some blazes and then let's get that portal set up. That was an enderman. Did you see that? Four. Okay, four is enough for now. Let's get out of here. Alright, let's try and find that village. The coordinates for the village. Okay, so we gotta go that way. For sure, we gotta be 17 on the C axis and we gotta be at 135 on the x so that's over here already but we gotta get ourselves over there somehow so let's see if i can somehow get there easily from up on here it doesn't seem to be that way uh oh wow well, uh, i thought i almost walked off oh my god like there's even more nether fortress all the way over there like this thing is massive do we kind of get to get there? No, not even. No, we just got to get down there. Or on top of that, where the blaze spawner is. Alright, let, let's uh, use the enderpearl. Now, we don't have to link it up exactly, so we can like make a bit of a... Yeah, maybe we'll make it over here. 
That, all right. Yeah, that pickaxe is way too quick. Uh, all right. So let's make it over here then. One, two, three. One, two, three. And we can actually finish off the top, which is nice. All right. Let's uh, let's see if I'm not an absolute idiot. This is gonna put me a few blocks away because like eight blocks difference is a lot. All right. This is fine. This is fine. Let let's like that's the village. So I got a quite alright. That's the boat. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep on here. Good thing I brought the bed with me. Oh, there's an enderman over there. Wait, wait, we can't sleep. Never mind. We gotta kill enderman. So let's go and kill that enderman. That's not. Oh, I'm really lucky on the ender pulse. So uh, you get out of this bed. All right, let's go and try uh, try find that fortress, I guess. The, the end fortress. Let's see if I'm lucky. But first, check out the boat. All right, I love the water breathing. Like, it's so great. Uh, let's see what we got here. If there's actually anything to... Yeah, there's a chest. That's just a bunch of books, but that's fine. And a bird treasure map. Right, uh, I don't think that's gonna be anywhere nearby, so... Oh, it is. Oh, we're definitely gonna check that one out. All right, so there should be a buried treasure over here somewhere. So let's, I think it's gonna be this. Yep, called it. More TNT, more iron, another diamond, a few emeralds. This is great. Another, di two diamonds even, I only saw one. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting, all right, this can be thrown in here. Is it worth to take the prismarine? I don't know. Do I need the golden sword? Do I need the iron sword? I need the heart of the sea for sure. Uh, I know I have potatoes, so I can lose that. So let's just break the chest, get the chest as well. And I don't think the rest is very useful, so... Yeah, this is why I need and chests and, and the shulker boxes and stuff like that. Because I'm just full and stuff already. Alright, we can throw away that, then we can throw away that. Alright, it went that way. Which is good, because that's not the direction of my base. Um, so let's see if it's worth to... Oh, it's the Dark Oak Forest. Alright. I think I'm just gonna swim it, because I my inventory is already full. And honestly, I can swim waterfalls many when there's like a dolphin around, so... It's gonna be fine. So I'll catch you up when I throw another. Uh, and I vendor. Alright, thanks to a dolphin I made my way over to the edge. It went a lot faster that way. And now let's try and get an advantage point to throw this thing. Like, there's probably going to be a 50% chance it's going to be under the sea, so let's throw it over here. No, it's still that way. Okay, that's good. Don't break, don't break, don't... Ah, it popped. Darn it. Alright, so let's keep going then. Alright, I've traveled quite a bit. This is quite a sizable fortress. Maybe this is in the direction of my home because this is a swamp again. I don't know. Yeah, that went to the right over here. But now I don't know if it broke or if it's somewhere. Uh, oh, yeah, it's in the tree. Okay, so that went over here then. Oh, that's gonna go backwards. Don't break. Ooh. Alright, so in that case... It should be somewhere in between here. So I'm just gonna do the one thing you should never do in Minecraft and dig down, maybe? Like, I don't know at what levels for to spawn, but I'm pretty sure it's like around 30-ish or 20-ish. That's a cave. Right, so this cave leads to absolutely nothing. Okay, I hear a spider. Or a silverfish. Right, that was a real block. Good guess on my part. Uh, yeah, that that's, uh, that's an iron door. That doesn't work like that. Alright. And uh, no. Alright. Well, we did find that's a creeper. We also found out it's infested with mobs. How wonderful. So now we just need to find the library room. No, like, I, I don't have any use for this right now. I, I do like the books, though, but I don't have the inventory space to really take anything with me. There is a chest over here, and I just want to look what's inside, though. Oh, okay, nothing like an enchanted book. And I just see there's one down there as well, so let's see what's inside that. And then let's actually try to find the central room. And of course I get stuck in copper. Also, we're not going to break these because these can be harvested, I believe, if you get silk touch shears. 
uh, which you need, can only get using a silk touch book, I believe. Uh, multi shot. I I actually did not know that was an enchantment, so that's interesting, and that did not work. All right, uh, let's uh, let's get out of here and let's try to find uh, the actual big room. All right, so here's a chest with an ender pearl and an iron chest plate, which is not very useful at all. The ender pearl might actually be very useful. All right, so it continues that way. There's something over there, which so we can check that out in a second. I want the ender pearl. Uh, all right, this is really annoying. The inventory management. Do I have pumpkins at home? I actually don't know, that's the problem. Alright, let's throw away the sword. I mean, it's not that important. Wow, that's... that's useless. Alright, so this one goes down again, but I'm pretty sure this is not the one I went up. Oh, here it is. Found it. Uh, sh yeah, let's just light this up. Wow. Yeah, that that's... that's very unlucky. Like I'm pretty sure like the most amount missing is like three of them and this is like uh, I've been so lucky so far and then I just get really unlucky on this one like the one thing I really wanted to be lucky on I've been so lucky on the ender pearls and stuff but that's a pain All right um what should we do we don't have a bucket of water so we can't really make an end portal here yet. We need to get some obsidian. Alright, I'll, I'll go scout around if I can find some obsidian. Why are there so many? Look at that. That's not allowed to flow in there. Okay, okay, now it's gonna flow down here. And now we just need to make it go down one more. And that should do it. And we got ourselves some obsidian. Alright, I think I'm making my way back. This is the library room. So we gotta find a way to get up, I believe. Man, these things are just very confusing. And now I'm back here again. Okay, okay, let's try this door then. Alright, I think this should be it. For sure. Alright, so now I'm in a big room and then this door should lead down. No. Alright, that's the chest. So this is where the, 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 okay. No, this is the one I came up. Of course it is. Alright, so this then should lead down to an area and that area should be the spawner room of course I was this close and still couldn't be able to uh, yeah. anyhow and I should really start being more careful than this all right let's get two chests in here because we don't want to take everything home let's just dump all these blocks in here because I don't want to waste them because I hate wasting blocks go die die now let's take actually some blocks with us because we gotta find a way through the nether. I hope this kind of just plops me up at the village, but I don't think it is. Is this is this my portal that I built to get to the village? <gasps> it is. All right, so that's actually kind of annoying. I I kind of gotta build another nether portal then for the end portal. But anyway, I now gotta get myself up there somehow so I don't know how but three endermans just spawned there so we're definitely gonna try and kill them I hope they don't die in the fire because that would be that's one pearl come on I need a lot of these that's oh wow have they increased the drop rate of ender pearls or am I just really lucky when it comes to ender pearls because I'm literally getting like an ender pearl on each enderman I kill and this sword is an enchanted, so I, I don't even know how this happens, but th thank goodness, because I need a lot as well. Seeing as my portal is kind of empty when it comes to having pre-spawned Eye of the Enders in there. So yeah, it's, it's very useful, don't get me wrong, but it's surprisingly lucky. Like, very, very lucky. Alright, I think this somehow is going to get me home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, alright. So I'm gonna figure out this maze. Oh, come on. Oh, that's a lot of blazes. Why are there so many? And of course there's a blaze over there as well. Alright, where's the other blaze, or the actual blaze spawner? Is it up there somehow still? Yes, it's further up there, I think. So then we actually gotta climb up here. 
Like, I just gotta find the nether portal. But <laughs> I don't know where it is, so I didn't mark it. Can't reach. Really? Who does that? Who, who who even does that to themselves? Like, I'm just sabotaging myself by now. Like, what idiot places a block up there? Whilst trying to jump. Like, how dumb can I actually be? Honestly, I don't even know anymore. Oh, am I lost? I'm definitely gonna be lost, aren't I? Alright, alright. I'm gonna go into the nether fortress again, because... Technically, one exit should lead to my end portal, or nether portal, I mean. So, if I go in the right way, at the right height, I should definitely be able to just get there. But, yeah, I'm a little bit doubtful about my capabilities of making this ID work. Seeing, uh, of course, I just wanted to get in here, and that's not the best way to get in here. Yeah, alright. Hi guys, bye guys. This isn't even in here. Alright, alright, alright. Down here. And then, then we'll go down there, which is definitely scary, yes. So maybe we gotta get up there? But I feel like that was where it just came from. Why is this, why is this place such a maze? Why is it so massive? We found another chest that I didn't check with two saddles and another chest that I didn't check. Alright, so let's turn this out and let's get this stuff. Alright, so yeah, I have not been here. I know that. But that's where my nether portal is, of course. You know, sometimes I just really, really, really hate this world. I wanted that saddle. Get me that saddle. I, 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 I'm going, I'm going out of here. Like, for reals. Alright, let's let's actually build it like... It's that close? It's literally down there? Like, look at this! How did I miss this? I, I, sh I could have been able to see through... Oh my god. Alright, yeah, everybody kill me in the comment section. Thank you. Like, tell me how bad I am. Please. Like, I need to hear it from you too, because... Just saying it to myself over and over again. Just is starting to lose its value. Yeah, this filler just stuck again on here and I don't know why. He, he just really seems to like the flower pot. What what happens if I break it? Oh, sorry dude. I, d I didn't mean to hit you. No, don't be mad, man. Oh, he's gonna be upset with me now, isn't he? Oh, yeah, he made his trade more expensive. It's so mean. Yeah, just go downstairs. Why 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 can you only climb up ladders? You should be able to climb down ladders. I, I don't know, villagers are dumb. Alright, anyhow, I think I'm just gonna end this episode off here. We've got a lot of good stuff, like in all honesty, it was a pretty good run. The only problem I have with this is, is that I just I'm just bad at this game. Like really bad. But we didn't got some decent loot, at least, uh, so that's nice. Got the buried treasure map, so that's another one. I'm definitely gonna make like a buried treasure map room where I'll put them all, for sure. Uh, anyhow, yeah, so that's gonna be the end of this episode. Next episode, I hope I'm gonna do some more stuff on this area, if I have the time to do so. And otherwise, the main goal of next episode is definitely getting to the end. And now that we found the end portal, we've got a, another portal there, but we need to make another one just to link it up. Which shouldn't be too hard to do, but I actually have to find my way back to the first portal I just remembered, and I never screenshotted it. I'm really bad at this game. Alright, anyhow, I'll, I'll get that fixed by next episode, or at least we'll go and check that out next episode. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, I hope to see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye!